The life that you want, the marriage that you want, the money you want to make, the family that you want, all will be fueled by the trucking business you build. Hi, this is Amrit, and in today's video, I will be giving you five top tips on how to find truck drivers for your trucking business. So first tip is, you want to first map out how many drivers do you exactly want to hire. And it may be very different for any of you, you know, any of you who are starting, maybe looking for their first driver. Some of you may have a couple of trucks, two, 10, 15 trucks, and looking for three, four drivers. And some of you may be having 200, 500,000 trucks, maybe looking for 200 drivers to hire and better strategy. It really doesn't matter because in all scenario, you want to map and plan how many drivers do you want to hire. It may not seem like, oh my God, this is something to do, but imagine if I left you in a jungle and I said like, get to the top of the hill and I didn't even tell you where the hill was, right? Now beneath this video, what I've done is I've given you an Excel, um, a spreadsheet, which you can download for yourself uh, if you click on that link, how I do it, okay? And it takes in consideration of the size of your fleet, how I map out those numbers. Second thing that you want to do is draft the kind of driver that you want to hire, okay? Because all of you guys may have very different uh, approach and the kind of driver that you're looking for, okay? Some of you may look for a driver that needs to haul a drive-in. Some of you are looking for a driver that can haul your refrigerated load. Some of you may be looking for a driver for flatbed, right? All these are different divisions of the trucking business where you need to find a driver that matches that, right? Like a dry van driver is gonna be scared to come into flatbed because it involves tarping, securing the load versus also another driver that likes to be home every night you're looking for a driver to run OTR lanes, right? So write that all down. What is the kind of driver that you're looking for? What is the pay that you're offering? What is the home time gonna look like? What kind of work they're gonna be involved in, okay? And any bonuses that you may be giving too. Write it down on a piece of paper for yourself. Again, there's a link beneath this video where you can download one uh, example that I've done for you that you can implement that I already give to so many trucking companies that work with us. Third tip is that do not ever start with posting on job sites. Now, why I say that is because job site is the first thing that anybody's mind comes into when you think of, oh, I need this driver post fill, this driver job fill, let me go to a job site. However, it may be true in any other position in the world that exists, maybe a dispatch position, maybe a safety manager, maybe a recruiter, maybe a financial person in your business. Yes, in order to find those people, you can go to a job site and you may have success, but not in finding drivers because drivers are in high demand and there's a massive shortage, right? And I'm sure you're frustrated and that's how you found this video in first place. So do not start with job sites. And the big reasons why you don't wanna start there is, as most carriers, is that's the place that they start with. If you go to any major job site right now and you search up truck driver jobs in your city, wherever you're looking for, you'll see there will be million different companies looking for that same driver. And most of the people, most of the trucking companies that are gonna come on the top are offering some sort of sign-on bonus, hefty money that you probably can't compete with. And if you can, you probably can't pay money day in and day out to that job site to stay on the very top to show your message, show your ad. So it's a race to the bottom because now you're competing against wages that you can't probably offer and you also have to spend money in order to stay on top of that page. If you don't believe me, do an experiment, post an ad right now and you'll see in an hour, you won't be even able to find your own ad. It will be buried like 10, 15 pages below. It's just the nature of the game right now because everybody wants drivers if you're running a trucking business. So do not start with that. Now a quick subsection of what I just mentioned, do not also work with recruiting agencies or marketing agencies. How that works is like if any great driver 
is not going to want to a third party person in order to get to your trucking business. They want to get the answers directly from you. And not only that, these third party companies or recruiters or leads or anybody who provides that, they don't have a silver bullet over what you know or what you have to offer. A great driver will always want to want answers directly from a trucking business. If a driver wants to know whether you have inward facing cameras, outward facing cameras, a recruiter cannot, a third party recruiter can never answer those questions because there's a million different questions like those. And if they're working with four to five different trucking companies, they're just gonna mix it all up. And that ruins your reputation because they may hear one thing from them and then when they talk to you, the answer could be totally different. And it happens all the time. Tip number four, go create a Facebook business page. Now, business page is completely separate and a different entity than your personal profile. Amrit and Raj is my personal profile, and then GetTruckDrivers.com is my Facebook business page. So I've included a link beneath this video, which takes you to and shows you exactly how to create the Facebook business page. It's not going to take you more than five minutes to do it, honestly. Once it's done, it's done. Tip number five, what you now need to do is create a small video with your phone, just hold your phone like this, and record yourself explaining in the video the driver that you're looking for and what are you offering. It has to be short, it has to be quick, and it has to get attention, okay? Just keep that in mind. And just show yourself in there. Why video over anything else? Because video builds trust. You know exactly by watching this video what I look like, how I move, how I talk. It subconsciously builds trust. That's the exact same thing what's gonna happen when you create a video that goes to the drivers that you're looking for because now they'll feel more trusted without even speaking or talking to you. Once you've recorded that video, put it on your Facebook page and then boost it a little bit. What it will do is it will bring you drivers and you will have the options of like who to target, what kind of drivers you're looking for. It will give you the options, very self-explanatory once you start doing it. What you will notice is it will give them the option to message you. You'll see it. It will give them the op option to message your page. Once you've started running that low video over to the drivers in your hiring area, wherever you're looking for, they can actually message your page. Once they message your page, you can actually talk to these drivers as you would text somebody as your friend on your phone. It's the exact same phenomenon. Now you can text and talk to them and see exactly if they are looking for what you're offering. If they do, guess what? You have a driver. And the more drivers you talk and get talking with you, the more drivers you're gonna hire, right? Because every single driver that's out there is probably not looking for what you're offering, but may get intrigued by your message or by your video. That's how you can hire a lot of good drivers that actually align with who you're looking for and what you're looking for. And the best way to have great drivers is they're the company that they love what they're getting. So I hope all these tips helped you tremendously. Now, if you want us to help you to find and get truck drivers and grow your trucking business, beneath this video, I've included a link where you can reach out to us. We work with some of the largest trucking companies in North America and also coach smaller to even the biggest trucking companies, all of those. So there's a link below. If you wanna reach out, we're here to help you. Now, make sure you like, comment and subscribe to this video. Let me know in the comments if there's something more that you wanted to learn, if there are more questions that you have, if there's something that you wanna learn exactly how to do it, let them know in the comments. I personally read them all and respond to them. And don't forget to hit that notification bell because anytime I release a great video like this, it comes directly to you. And I will see you in the next video.